I'm currently finishing up the Agco Rotary Pack for FS19 and I wanted to share my latest progress. In addition to the Challenger and the Massey, I now have the Gleaner A85 running inside 19 and skinned. I'm going to update some of the features because there may be viewers who are just interested in the Gleaner version, but all three will be in the Rotary Pack. I've also updated the header to have the 9250 Dynaflex logo there that matches the Gleaner, so all flows well. I've also staged another version of the A85 over in the cornfield, and we can take a look at that as well and see it harvest corn. Inside, I've added the Agco white logo to the steering wheel, as well as the 85th anniversary Gleaner stitching there on the seat. And let's fire this up. So there, you'll notice that the uh, dashboard came on. You've got RPM, miles per hour there. The joystick's animatable. And uh, let's go outside. We'll unfold. So unfolding, I moved the ladder from the interactive control into the unfold and fold animation. So that's all functioning smoothly. And we'll go harvest with this, and I'll talk a little bit about uh, what I've done. Let's get a little closer here. So we'll just go a little ways here. So there's smoke added to the Dynaflex header as well. There was a small issue when I, or maybe not small, but it took me a while to fix when I originally converted the 680B i3D over that I've used to, screen, uh, to skin for the cleaner. And it was with the fill volume, so I had to fix the fill volume. There was an issue where the polygon was rendering out of it. But now all of that's functioning just fine. The uh, the Gleaner also has uh, working blinkers. So I just turned the blinker on. There's the other side. We'll go up here a ways and come back. So turn the blinker off. Have horn. Also have lights. So there's front working, back work lights, high beams, that. You have the option of whether you want duals, broads, or narrows when you purchase any one of the Agco rotary combines, the Gleaner one included, in the uh, shop. And uh, the pipe out also works. Stop to show the effects there so you can pipe out. Let's keep going here instead of go down around the field down the hill here we'll, we'll cut over here so the Dynaflex header the reel raises and lowers and extends so all the hydraulics are functioning there also when you turn the lights on you'll see they light up in the cab the dashboard lights up lights off inside so that's all working great it looks really sweet um, I'm really happy with how the textures are rendering in 19 fill volume you get smoke coming up in the fill volume there too. I will come up here and I'll show you guys hit discharge. There's the discharging. So unloading into the uh, C70.
All right, that pretty much covers a quick view of this one harvesting wheat, the A85. Let's jump over, and I've got this one. This has the broad tires on it, and we'll actually just uh, harvest some corn with this one. Um, we want to unfold the harvester here so we can go harvest. So we'll get a little closer here. And I'm just going to go straight through here just so we can see the effects. I'm really pleased with the A85's look and feel. Uh, I think the colors look really smooth. I'm using the 12 row Capello header. There's a bigger and smaller row size. I used the, the silver color. I tried the Agco gray, but it just doesn't quite match. Uh, and there is no gleaner color, so the silver is the color you're seeing here if you want to try that out when the mod's available. I'm still working the mods. I've got uh, a few more things to work through and some of the pictures and textures I'm editing still. As soon as it's all done I'm going to make a few more passes then I'm going to bundle everything up and stick it out for the community. I had gotten several requests for the Massey and for the Gleaner once I had completed the Challenger so I'm really glad I took the time to do that because in 17, I had only pulled out the Challenger, and uh, I think this uh, this will bring a nice set of Agco capability to FS19. So once I get that done, uh, I will actually uh, push that out to the community. If you like the Agco Rotary Pack, definitely subscribe to my channel. I don't use other social platforms. It's just easy for me to do the YouTube videos to show the work and to get feedback from the community on things that could be improved uh, or areas of interest. So um, yeah, if you like it, definitely subscribe and I appreciate you watching. Thanks.